back into the fray. Oh, here I am. Here face I am. Just covered in blood. There I go. <laughs> Woo! Uh, someone's been farming jump rings. <laughs> I can't. Off the Jugurtha quest. Oh, it I hurts see. me so much to do that. Uh, all right, let me uh, put on my real rings here in a second. I I planned that intro for like a week and a half, ladies and gentlemen. So yeah, it's been a long time. I hope you. Well, we've it. been doing Bactor's LP. <laughs> And Only technical so difficulties. And, uh, yeah, yeah, boring. Boring things to talk and complain about. So I'm putting so on... So here we are. Yes. Do you remember where we are? We are in the... Uh, we are looking for the Orb of Destruction, which is a tactical nuke, more or less. Right. And... We are in oh the my Altar goodness. of Fire. <sighs> oh, gosh. <laughs> I got obliterated right then. Hey, guess Take what I'm going to turn on is maybe my fire protection spell. You are so smart. <laughs> yeah, you're going to be married to that spell for this quest. Man, I am too. Hint, hint, there's a lot of fire in it. No kidding. So these guys are jerks. Is it insulate? Uh, Is that right? No, no, that's that's lightning. Uh, frost you want code. Uh, frost code, yeah. Here we go. So these are mercenaries of the fire altar. Mm hmm. As their description reads, their armor is wizardly. Wizardly armor, good. Yep. And that means that they are immune to all sorts of stuff. Oh, gosh. Yep. Yeah, yeah, they're not bleeding from my uh, diamond edge, I'll tell you that. Nope, they're immune to fire, they're immune to physical, and they're immune to the poison status effect. Oh my gosh. They are not immune to poison damage, so if you slap them with venom, they will take okay. damage. Okay. Um, do you have... I have Vindicator. That helps us Okay, fire. that's physical damage. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Well, I'll tell you what I'll do is I'll swap you Venom here All right. for Diamond Edge. Perfect. And then I will cast Shocking Grasp. Excellent. All right. Let me recast All my this. fire protection spell. And let's try this again. Oh, that's satisfying. Mm-hmm. You know they're immune to a lot, but they don't seem to be particularly hard-hitting. Uh, you say that because you've got your fire resist spell. Oh, oh, oh I see. These fire bolts do a lot of damage. Yeah. So they have a really obnoxious sound effect. They do? Is that them taking damage? Yeah. Are they hurt by the lava or what? Oh no, that's, that's you. They're hurt by you, I see. <laughs> They're hurt by me hitting them <laughs> in the face with a lightning they sword. They are vulnerable to your attacks. Yep. All right. So I'll just take this in the teeth because uh, I don't care. I'm uh okay. I'm there in a second. The corridor trapped me. Oh wait, what's this? The tower is a sacred site for the forces of evil. Uh huh. And so it is. I could. I would say something about the idea of evil having sacred sites. You know, but... you need to be more tolerant of purest black evil uh-huh do i uh i'm out of out of man i am quick, so just hang on. brimming me... with fire resist however i can divine that this passage was not invented for multiplayer because uh -huh. boy we sure can't squeeze by each other no sir they do have an annoying sound effect there don't they yep oh whoa hey jump this Oh, gosh. But before we started recording, I insisted that Factor buy a ring of Ignore Terrain, mm. and this is why. Oh, is this ice? You are kidding me. This is ice, yes. Oh. And that is quite enough demonstration. Oh, have you been demonstrating it? I was going to take off my... Uh... I left it off for the folks at home. Wow. This would be now unimaginably I'm... annoying. I mean, this would be annoying to the point of no thank you. Mm -hmm. Uh... This room, you might. Why don't you come back to the entrance here? Okay. Real quick. Hold on a second while I uh, murder this last man. Here. Yeah. See, that's the thing. In this room, there is no last man. Oh, oh, oh I see. They just teleport in, and there may be a finite amount, but if there is, right. I don't care about it's it. It's like many tens or something. I hate this room. Oh. I hate it, and I hate you for <laughs> making me come here. But. 
they just teleport in and they since their AI has them run away when you oh, attack them. Yeah. And they slide around on the ice and they run around and they have tons of HP and they're immune to everything and wow, I hate this room and I hate it and I hate <laughs> Okay, so, uh, so what we're going to be doing is ignoring them. Yes. We're just going to be hustling and bustling. And first place we're going to hustle and bustle is into the secret door. Oh, hey! Hustle and bustle. Oh, wait. Uh, can I go back there for one second? I saw a poison mace I wanted to pick up. Oh, well, sure. I'll be right we'll back. We'll be coming back here. Oh, uh, well, never mind then. I'll, I'll follow you. Yeah. There's a pyrenium mace. Hey! That is almost certainly better than what I had planned. Uh, yeah, you know, probably not, because pretty much everything from here to the end of the game, it just does not give two flips about fire. Oh, really? Yep. That is, uh, I might question that. Whoa, what is that? I don't know and, what you're talking about. And that about. is an amethyst wyvern, and yes, you do. You do know <laughs> what I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. All right, murdered that man. I need my frost coat spell. So the amethyst wyvern, 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 however it's pronounced, uh, shoots acid. Yes. So we have not seen our last of. Oh this no! Is... So this is another uh, uh, equipment destroyer then. Yes. Yes, that's exactly what Good. it is. Good. Just what I was hoping for. He's so stupid hey, looking. Hey jerk! I mean, he's big. You gotta grant him that. He. Uh... Yeah. He's just big and dumb. Wow. He's not particularly durable. No kidding. He doesn't have a lot of I was sort speed. of expecting more of a challenge there. I mean, look at all yeah. these sacred statues that he's got going for him. <laughs> yes, sir. He's got so many sacred statues. There's a switch back here. Okay. Hey, look at that uh, treasury that he was guarding. Yeah. I'm gonna pick up that gold because old habits die hard. Even though we don't need it at all anymore. No. By far the most valuable treasure here is the Man, diamond. Why would this be on a timer? <laughs> because amulets and armor. <laughs> I mean, clearly, if we're looting this thing, we've killed the Y. Oh well, whatever. Fine. Yeah. So this is kind of a neat chamber. I've got to give it that. It's got the temple sort of aesthetic going here. Uh, yeah, it's texture stolen from the last quest. Yeah, I no think. kidding. No, no, no. It uh, really is. So somebody's plinking away at us. I just don't see. Oh them. yeah, there's some of those fire archers. They fall in the lava and they don't die from it because right. they're immune to fire. Well, hey, guess who's not gonna go down and deal with them? <laughs> me. It's me. Yeah. So you can farm these guys for fire bolts, but again, kind of the wrong time to be doing that. Right. Right. So that's um. Maybe what it, what you might call like a questionable decision or something like that. <laughs> you might call it that. It's yes. uh, <laughs> it's giving us fire. Yeah, here's a, a pyrenium mace, for instance. So yeah, giving us fire-based equipment right when everybody stops caring about fire is uh, right. Hmm. So this is just I hate yeah. Well, and this I mean this is this stage is just made out of annoying. Is that the idea? Mm -hmm. it's... That's pretty much it. Here here's this. Oh hey, there's the the green the, mace. I got the mace there. Yeah, you can ID that if you like. Sure. I will pick up these scrolls. These are all the same scroll. I picked up mine. This it is, is Earthbind. The mace the Earthbind of venom. Spell. Yes. So much damage on it. Boy, that is a uh, blustery wind sure coming out of nowhere there, isn't it? Yes. That stupid, uh... The mace, incidentally, does five damage, okay. while venom does uh, seven. Oops. I just, I'm not getting the like design that. decisions for this last bit here, but all right. Uh, yeah, this one, I'm not sure. But I mean, uh, uh, I'm not sure what they're going for the, here. The scuttlebutt, the rumor around the water cooler, is that this is not your favorite level in this quest. <laughs> you mean that I told you that loudly and frequently? <laughs> yeah, just throwing things and being belligerent. Uh, where'd you get to? I am following the left wall. And I'm just getting shot left and right. Okay, so are you back in the the annoying area following the left wall? Is that right? Or? I'm following the left-hand wall until I found a passage. Okay. Yes, I'm back in the annoying area. Okay, because I think I actually made it back to the entrance. Shooting. Following the left-hand wall here. There's there you a... go. Hello. Hello. Oh. So I'm in this room here. Yes. Ah. Uh. 
Let's see. Those uh, those hats are kind of an interesting design. The uh, coat yeah. head look. They're very Nebuchadnezzar. Yeah, I or guess that's perhaps nice. Garden Gnome. <laughs> Gnome Nebuchadnezzar. Tell me, when you look on the works, do you despair? Uh, I have despaired. I've despaired three or four times since we've started this quest alone. I believe the uh, the Japanese phrase is Zetsubashita, for I'm in despair. Mm -hmm. It's, it's mm -hmm. a good one just to shout, you know. Just. I understand. Here, here's a document. Oh, hey, documents. Here are. I am a fiend for reading these things. Uh -huh. And I'll tell you why. Because if I read them all, I'll get the achievement. No, you won't. I'll hold out hope. Here it is. Hello, I'll make fun letter. of you is what will happen. The Death Priest Matan performs dark rites at the tower altar. Alright. What a jerk, huh? I gotta say, that sounds like the kind of thing he would do. So this play, this is where yeah, the wyvern this is. is. The, the wyvern. And you can shoot him from here. Of course. If you care to. You're a wizard or an archer or something. I haven't bothered to test all the elements he's vulnerable or strong yeah, to, but basically, is. if he's not immune to physical damage, I don't really care about anything right. else. Oop, got to protect myself. There we go. Man, you do swing like crazy. Just like a madman. It's mm -hmm. that, uh, is it, I think it's the, uh, the necklace I bought, right? Yeah, speed, your speed necklace. Yeah. Best so here we have an incredibly long, spent. windy My passage. Goodness, this passage! And, Where do you uh, think this goes? Oh, right back to the beginning. <laughs> is this the end? <laughs> no, this is the beginning. Oh, I see. Let's oh, well, get out of here. All right. I'm going uh, down a long, featureless passage. All I think there's along. one more room we haven't been to. All right. Which is in a little side passage off of that. Uh, the iceberg lounge. So, if uh, we're going to describe this level in two words, do you think we could go for mercifully short? Uh, yeah, that'd be a good good way to describe it. But man, it sure wasn't mercifully short when I was mapping the whole place. Oh, out. I bet. Here's or, some more earthbind scrolls. I'm just following the left-hand wall some more. Or the first time when you thought, I know, I'll take out all these guards. Right, exactly. And then, nope. I mean, it, there's no so it's no secret that we are like six levels too high to need to be to be right the game. right so we don't need xp we don't need equipment here it is hey, jump get stuffed i don't mind killing the guys in here where they don't respawn right yeah that's fine hey are these uh some red pants for me no, indeed. pyrenium plate leggings Ah, <laughs> splendid. <laughs> Look at my red trousers. Yes. All right, what do we got here? Near the tower, a pride of griffins roam the skies. Oh. I guess it's called a pride. That's the, yeah. Well, part of it's a pride, and part of it would be a flock, I guess. Uh-huh. Are there three elements to a griffin, or is it just eagle and lion? Uh, for a griffin, it's eagle and lion. Yeah. For a manticore, you have scorpions. Right, scorpions as well. in there too. That's that's sort of your uh, your classier griffin, if you will. I, I mapped this place a couple times, and I don't really remember it all, so I'm just following walls. Well, see, this is uh, adding, I guess, one little voice to the shrill chorus of complaints: is that boy, is this featureless? Yeah. You know, <laughs> it's it's not quite as bad as the. Uh, the hallway where the floor, ceiling, and walls oh, I know, literally yeah. all had the same texture. The undulating intestine texture mm -hmm. or whatever. All right, I see. But even now. that was weird enough to be funny. You know, I it's found a... the exit. All right, I'm with you. So I'm just, I'm yeah. out of here. Boy, it's a, it's a tough road for those mercenaries, just mm -hmm. locked in their, in their stupid uh, ice cavern forever. Us utterly ignoring them. Are right, you want to go back That's to the true. shop? Yeah, let's go back to the shop. All right. Well, I am interested in powering on through if that's... Uh... Yeah, the next level is short enough to do this all in one run. Cool. So uh, we'll probably edit out the shop business, and I'll see you folks back in a second. I don't see why we edited it out. This is quality entertainment. We return... To, to a howling wind. To fight face. more chumps. Uh -huh. Probably. 
Man, it is howling, isn't it? Yeah. It's a bit hard to hear you. <laughs> well, we'll just go inside this ominous black hole. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I can't really imagine why we wouldn't. Onward! Woo! Mm -hmm. Any liches out there? Yeah, just me. Oh. Well, I'm afraid you know the saying. Whoa! That was pretty cool. Hmm? I have to say, well, I opened the door right as you uh, let loose your torrent of just awful death magic. It is oh, impressive yeah. from a side view. Man! This would be the worst place to have to, like, eat your dinner. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this thing. Are you kidding me? That pouch mm -hmm. had seven gold pieces. That is an insult at this stage in the game. Well, no one said the mercenaries were wealthy. No, I suppose that's true. They are pretty it's, well armored. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And they do... A couple scrolls there for your perusal. Good. Uh, I'll be honest, see. these guys are the reason I bought that lightning wand. Oh, yeah. Um, Elmore slew the consort of the dragon Melakarch, which I feel like we sort of knew that already. Yes. The forces of evil were loosed. Which, you know, that's just sort of the way that goes. Boy, it would be just so loud in here and so hot. I mean, look at that. There's a gout of flame coming up from that lava. Yeah, but these guys wear magical fire immunity armor. Ugh. All the time. Yeah. It's a hard road to hoe, being a mercenary. Oh, it could be worse. Oh, sorry about sorry. that. All right. Uh, did you wail on that guy a little bit? Nope. Because I feel like they've I had... People have had just, like, wildly different HPs then. Yeah, at this point, your crit rate is high enough oh, that you basically, if you get lucky, you can wipe people out real quick. Yeah, that makes sense. Did they say hello? Sure. Also, are they undead? Because I feel like their blood is the uh, cobwebs and bone dust effect. Um... I mean, I that's the lightning. Alive. That's the lightning sparks. Oh, I see. Mercenary of the Fire Altar. Okay. Such jerks. I was like... You know what this reminds me of? Uh, this reminds me of where we fought Jugurtha. Mm-hmm. I bet it does. Or, uh, there's something else down here. Yeah. Oh, me, Did you yeah. find the switch? No. There's a lever hidden in this maze. A lever. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, let's see. Where is that lever? Let's pull that lever. I hear some teleport spells. Yeah, we'll be oh, seeing the source of that soon enough. Are there infinite mans again? Or? No, well, yes, but... Not here. Not here. Where so, that go? switch, if you go back to the hot, hot dining room... Yes. Ooh, hold on, I got a dark red potion. Good. Specifically, I got a potion of fire. Right, okay. that's basically lava in a bottle. Ah, uh, right. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna drink it. Okay. Ow, my stomach's on fire! Uh-huh. It did one point of damage. <laughs> this crystal shoots you with a million million fireballs if oh, you gosh. don't pull that switch. I'm glad I pulled so... that switch. Oh, uh, door's locked. Here. Yeah, I'm getting my thing out. The All wizard? these doors are double locked, so here I'm we go. gonna... Quickly pop them all. Well, now what is this? A protection from fire scroll. That's nice. I'll take that. You will. There it is. Thank you. I'll just use my spell for that purpose. Yeah, they're identical effects. Of course. Uh, in here we have a health potion, a health scroll. All right. So, um, where are we? I don't understand the question. Yes, um, the location where we are, we think that the crystal might be here? The orb? Look, we went to Isaias' vineyard, right? Uh -huh. Yes. To try to find the orb of destruction. Yes. And someone had And actually... then we've just been hopping in teleporters. Ah, uh -huh, right. 
That's that's all we've been doing. You since. know what they need to do is just drop a boulder on one of the teleporters they used to escape, and we would be foiled just utterly. <laughs> we would have no recourse. Man, your effects are just impressive. Just fire and lightning everywhere. Uh, I'm afraid the fire is actually from oh, them shooting yeah. me. Alright, well, there goes that man. This ceiling is so thoroughly supported. Oh man, I went to a courtyard. Did you? I did. I'm gonna kill some mans in there. Well, good luck to you. Oh, is this an infinite room? Oh gosh. This is a mini boss. Who is this man? That is Nimrud, the oh, mighty really? hunter. Of, uh, yes. of the hunter fame? Yeah, I see. Okay. Not Nimrod, mind you. Nimrud. Oh, you are kidding. I <laughs> thought you were doing one of your little ironic pronunciations. Nope. Secretly, I hope you were doing one of your little ironic pronunciations. There are infinite archers in this room, so our goal is to assassinate Nimrod. Hey, Oops. there we go. Put him down. Well done. Interestingly, if you right-click his corpse, yeah, I noticed it doesn't that. give you the normal body description. It just calls him Mighty Hunter. I guess now he's just an object. Yeah. So I hopped on that big platform in the center of the room. Okay. Which uh, is the switch to activate the next thing. And is that it? is back near the fire dinner. Okay. So we, I, should I go back up into that room? No, no, come back to the uh, flaming dining room. Oh, okay. Boy, is that a persistent uh, flaming sort of a sound effect there. Yeah. All right, flaming dining room. I'm there. Yeah, come, come through here. Oh, where is you? Hello, right here. Okay. This door is opened up now. Oh, I see. Oh, the one that said this door is opened elsewhere. I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. You don't actually have to kill Nimrod, but I mean, come on. Oh, why would we not? Are you kidding me? Alright. I've been poisoned. What a coincidence! <laughs> uh, what do we got up here? It's actually kind of dangerous when you have zero HP all the time. <laughs> yeah. Okay, there's two switches here. Uh, one of them is pulled, the other's not. The switch that's... Basically, one of them opens the exit, and the other one closes it again, if for some reason you want to close it again. Uh -huh. So I have opened it. All right. That's all we need to do. Excellent. Let's uh, let's get out of here. Did you get the uh, scroll? Divine. Yeah. Yes. Or divine. Divine. De yeah. De divine. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> uh, this whole place. Nimrud, Nimrud the divine. <laughs> the divine. <laughs> uh, so where's the? Oh, there you go. You got it. All right.